Hello ladies and gents, Ro here, and welcome to Normal Films. Today, we're going to continue our iMovie tutorials, and in this tutorial, we're going to cover iMovie, with the new version of iMovie, and how to export images, or take images from an event, or within your project, and put them on your desktop, that way you can use them elsewhere. So let's begin, I'm going to open up iMovie, and uh, show you guys here, that I am actually running on the newest version of iMovie. I'm going to go to iMovie, about iMovie, show you iMovie 10.0.6, and uh, just to let you guys know, this feature is only available in 10.0.6, 0.6. There are other ways to do this within the older versions, but I do recommend you update to OS 10 Yosemite, the newest version of Mac um, OS as of right now, and it is free within that could be found within your app store. So now that I have that out of the way, I'm going to begin by I'm actually going to my event, iMovie event, my tutorial project, and I'm going to delete within everything within that project and just select a clip here. And we're gonna add that clip straight to my project and show you guys here. Um, real quick, I'm gonna show you in the previous versions, you were able to simply create a still frame. If, if you right click on a certain portion, let's say I want, as soon as my hands separate here, I want this to be an image. You could simply go right click and you could go to add freeze frame and I'll put that into a freeze frame. Well, actually, since I didn't select that choose, I'm gonna select it right there. Then I go to add freeze frame you're able to actually reveal this in Finder. If you have this still frame and you right click it, you're able to reveal in Finder in the previous versions. And um, the newest versions, <coughs> you weren't able, you're now unable to actually find them within Finder, which is kind of disappointing because that was a very, a very simple way to get grab the image. So in this, the newest version of iMovie, you're now able to simply select, choose anywhere you like. You can do a freeze frame or you could do, let's say, for example, as soon as my hands go together here, I want this to be an image. All you have to do is just select it, select at that portion just like this. Now you see this line. This line is here, meaning that that portion right there is where I want that image to be, right where my hands are connected. And we're going to go to share, top right hand corner here, and we're going to go share as image. And for this I'm going to share it straight to my desktop, that way it's easy to find, and I'm going to name it My Tutorial. So it's going to be a My Tutorial JPEG, most likely, as an image. So share, show you this progress bar at the very top right hand corner, and it shouldn't take like less than 5 seconds because it's only, you're exporting just an image. Minimize iMovie here and show you guys that on my desktop here I have My Tutorial JPG file which is an image of what I export and I just opened that twice accidentally but there you guys have it that's how you export as an image be sure to leave any comments or questions in the comment section below I'll get back to you as soon as possible and maybe even make a YouTube video response tutorial thank you guys for watching catch you guys next tutorial and later Let my life be the proof, the proof of you.